Consistency of Angus. This is the last one. Okay. <laughs> How many of you here are the youngest child in your family? Yeah. How many? One, two, three, four, five. This story is for you. Today I am going to tell the timeless tale of a person who lived before 4,000 years ago. He had the courage, faith and determination even though he was rejected by his family, father and friends, he was sent to the wilderness. His family was having 12 members and he was the youngest. You may be noticing the youngest one will be loved by their parents but will be hated by the higher siblings because they will try to dominate them and uh, finally I am also the youngest one that is why I chose this. In my family, five members, I am the last one. While my mother was admitted in hospital and uh, she given birth, one lady from next door told my father, which is the child? It's a boy. Then she asked, is black color or white color? <laughs> my father told black color. Then the lady told my father, your life is gone. <laughs> Because fifth child, last child, if he is black, your life is gone. But the same way, my family spoiled after my birth. So my family is thinking I am the cursed child. The same way, the family of David who lived before 4,000 years, he was the 12th child. So his father, what he did is, 11 children, he sent to the army for working. This, this child, he chose him to take care of his uh, sheep and he became a shepherd. He was in the wilderness, nobody to help him. What happened is one day his father called, called him, come here, go and visit your uh, brothers in army. There is a big fight is going on. There is going to be a battle. Two countries is fighting. Give them some food. So this uh, his father gave him food and sent him to the army to see his uh, brothers. And he went to the army and see. There was one great giant. Big giant. He is challenging his country people. In those days, he told, instead of fighting all persons together, choose one among you and send, it, send him to me. If you want me, my country people will be slaves to you. If I want him, your country people has to be slave to us. So nobody was willing to go to go and fight with him. Even, even the king not able to fight with him. But this shepherd boy, David, went and he is not allowed inside the camp of the war. He's staying outside and hearing that giant is shouting, come, come, I want to fight. Send one. This person, David, he told the king, I am going to fight with this giant. The king asked, how you will fight? He told, one day, one jackal came to take my sheep. And I killed that jackal using this stone. Another day, one bear came to take my sheep. And I killed that bear using this stone. Another day, one lion came, I used this stone. King was laughing at me, how you will fight with the stone? But what David did is, he used his time of tranquility in knowing how to use this stone effectively. Toastmaster Jamnadas had a stone of hard work, so he is surviving still here. He had the stone of hard work in his life. Today check your pockets, you have the stone in your life. You have to sharpen it. I came to Toastmaster to sharpen my stone, same like Toastmaster Jambada, so that I will be surviving using the stone of hard work. What David did is, he convinced the king. Then the king told, okay, you wear my dress, everything. Then he tried to wear it, his dress, trying to walk, he could not walk, because there was no practice. He told, the stone is enough for me. 
then he was able to convince sometimes you have to convince the people that i could do i can win because you have the ability of using your stone effectively then the king allowed he went to the battle and killed the giant using the stone in my life also because of i am the fifth child my parents joined me in tamil medium my brother is they joined in english medium because i am a caste one black color they joined me in tamil medium what i did is i failed the all of my subjects in the degree then again i tried and i i passed then i sent application to all the companies i did not have a passport but i had the stone of consistently trying again and again i sent 500 application to all the companies in chennai out of 150 application my application selected for south bond post because even though i could not do i will not do any job i know how to prepare a good cv <laughs> <laughs> then i got selected here and i am surviving here for the last 25 years using my small stone of consistency say to yourself do you have a stone in your life consistent stone use it you may be in the wilderness you may be rejected by your family you may be rejected by your father friends and the society don't worry you have a stone in your life to win use it for your benefit use it for the benefit of the society like the same way david written so many songs while he was in the wilderness today now i am also singing you know nobody hearing it <laughs> i'm singing because it makes me happy i do whatever makes me happy if you hear it or not no problem <laughs> so find out your stone today be a winner in your life thank you